All right, guys, welcome back to the Siege of Paris. We are on the second to final part, everyone. This is going to be freaking crazy, man. I'm excited to see what happens next, and uh, we got to go confront Count Odo, I guess. So we're going to try and get this, like, I know I'm really bad at this, but I'm really trying to get those, like, assassinations, like those special ones. So I'm going to really try my best to get this, like, special assassination... If there is one, anyways. Or, like, so whatever these optional things are, you know? But, man. Everything has just gone to crap, yo. This is... Oh, my goodness. It's a bit insane. All right, this is an optional thing, I think. So, let's do it. Smucker, I last saw you in the tunnels. That was before your army started the burning and pillaging. This slaughter is not my doing. I mean to end this. You have not won yet. Charles is marching toward Paris with his heavy horse. Gods. His army comes. Well, this, they are close and riding hard. All the more reason I must hurry and end this thing. I need a hidden way into Odo's palace. I know a way. But there is a band of Frankish warriors milling about. Show me. Upon my honor, I give you my word that Toker and I, we do not want this. Fine. I will lead the way. All right, sweet. Let's do it. Yeah, we definitely don't want all this, like, bloodshed and everything. So we're gonna keep trying to find a way to have, like, peace. And I feel like there still is. We might have a chance. Those guards are too close to the tenant. I will chase them off. We will die if we don't get into other... Come on, bring it. There it is. Come here. Piece of freaking crap. I'll take long. I will feast on your coat. And you're done. I will bury you. It is done, my lady. Hurry now, Evo. Down into the dark we go. Oh shoot. I didn't even know where I was going. <laughs> that works. That tunnel takes you into the palais. Thank you, Norman. And you? I will save what I can of my trade goods and leave through other tunnels. Godspeed, Evo. A safe journey to you two. A fine hall of Norse war gear and Frankish riches. Sweet. Like oh my gosh, there's rats. Smuggled for bolts. Oh my god. I love how they kind of changed some things. Like, you know, like they added rats into this. And some rat abilities, which is also pretty freaking cool. Alright, we gotta be careful here. Double assassination, maybe? Guess not. We're good. We're chillin', man. We're chillin'. Now to sneak inside Odo's palace. Oh no. Look how many guards there are, man. You gotta be kidding me. Hey, oh my god. What? We're screwed. We're screwed. Grab and go. I would totally get that treasure, but I'm good. We're going, we're going, we're going. No escape and no Jeez. How can you think of an animal last day of all days? Just hide, just hide, just hide. I spend my last moment scrubbing floors or making love. Oh my god. God have mercy on your soul, Abuda. They are on the lookout. Sneaking through the back door like that. Following that love-struck maid should lead me into the palace. Oh, you're kidding. I gotta follow her. Oh my god. I gotta stick to the bushes. Please don't go the other way. Okay, yeah, nice, nice, nice. She's coming to me. What the? Oh, shoot. Go, 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 go. Oh, no, no. Please don't come down here. Guys, just chill out. <laughs> How does she not hear me, man? Why do I have this? 
Oh, I guess it doesn't matter. Oh, where is my These pillow? tunnels should lead right under the palace. Oh. Guess we're good. Man, I'm so nervous. I really... We're doing this optional thing, so hopefully we don't mess this up again. I've messed it up quite a bit. I actually looked up the special assassinations you could do, and man... They looked actually freaking sick. The not gonna lie. Taken the key with him after reading that note. <sighs> Door locked. Uh oh. Easy does it. Oh no. Now that I'm inside the palace, I need to find someone to point me toward Odo. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! There's someone over here. Yikes. Are oh, you kidding? He has the key? Oh, you're joking, man. Let me just go upstairs. Okay, we can talk to this guy. Maybe there's a way. Pardon me, good sirs. Where may I find the Count Odo? Count Odo? Who cares about Count Odo? Where is our good friend Walter de Sans? Oh, why? Who is Walter de Saint? A great warrior? Walter? A warrior? No. He is Count Odo's family priest. He's begging Odo to give us more wine. Huh? We plan to be passed out drunk by the time the Northmen bust into here. Odo's priest might lead me to Odo. But I need to sneak past these guards to the servant's wing. Uh, this is my Come first on, time luring a drunk. Stuff. You don't mind if I... Along. Oh, here we go. Create no distractions. here after all. Please work. Are you no <laughs> oh my God, it works. Not. <laughs> Where is it? Where is oh my glorious? God, I cannot believe that worked. I don't know where to go now. Even more guards in this hallway. Oh, this is scary. Oh man, that's locked. Odo's bedroom. If his wife is inside, she might know where he is. What am I to do, yo? Oh my god, they're everywhere. And they're all big dudes, too. That's a scary thing. Oh my god. Yikes. This is so bad. This is so bad. I need to get in that room. Oh my god. Please. Please. I'm in a bad situation right now. There's a piece of paper right there. You got it. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, easy, easy. Nice. Going, going, going. I will not attend to you. I will never. Pardon me. Is that food for Count Odo? No, this is for Lady Theodora, his wife. She lies at death's door. And who are you in such garb? A healer from Frisia. What happened to the lady? While helping wounded soldiers off the walls, she took an arrow in the belly. Ooh. Persuade that worthless priest Walter to give her the last rites if you can. He's just upstairs. I will see what I can do. Thank you. Oh my lady, why oh the count will not attend to you? Upstairs. I will never be off limits. Children, to think it's so stubborn that Odo and that pathetic Walter du Sens, too drunk to give last rites, a travesty that means. Oh my goodness. Special wine, maybe for a high feast, could come in handy. I'm so nervous, yo. There are big guys everywhere. <laughs> Yikes. Oh my. Where am I to go? Oh, up there. Thank God there's no guards in here. Disgrace before God. Pardon me, Father. Where is Count Odo? Odo? His foolish pride will kill us all. Yes, but where is he? Who are you again? No, I can tell you 
nothing without more wine. Ah, my memory has gone all hazy. Here's your wine. Now do you remember where is Count Odo? Wine? Ah, sweet, precious wine. The water of life, the blood of Christ, the fiery flame of the world. Red wine, nothing more. You may have it. Oh, heaven hears my prayer. Now, I can what? die. Uh, before you do, where is Count Odo? Although, I do not know. But his wife lies wounded in their master bedroom. She may have answers. On the second story, along the main hall. Here, take the key. I lock the door. Thanks. I should head to Odo's bedroom. Oh, wow. Odo's bedroom, huh? And where is that? Oh, it's that door that was locked. Okay. Gosh, guys, I'm going for it. I'm in. Whew. That was rough. Is that you, Odo, my love? No. You're too tall. Are you the priest? The light has grown dim. I see nothing but shapes. <laughs> Father, will you hear my confession? Oh, wow. Um. Ah, oh, yes. I am the priest, your ladiness. Forgive me, Father, for I have sinned. In my own pride, I went to battle. Without armor, thinking God would be my shield. And now I'm dying, and I will never see my sweet children again. Where are they, Father? Are they safe? They uh, are safe with that good man, Walter de Saint. Do not fear. Thank you. But, Father, please, will you carry a message for from a dying woman to her beloved husband. I will, my dear. What should I tell Count Odo? That he is a good man. That he must live for our children's sake. For Paris. For Francia. He must not die for a mad king. I promise I will do this, good lady. Where may I find your husband? <coughs> Odo remains locked in his sanctum. His sanctum? Up the landing and across the hall. My husband still hopes Charles will ride forth and save the city. Locked in, you said. There is a key in the bureau. Take it. Help my husband. Anyway, you can. Death creeps upon me now. But slow and quiet. Like a shadow at day's end. Eyelids so heavy. Mother. Where are you? Farewell, good lady. Dang. That's crazy, yo. I feel really bad, but that makes me think because I have a dying message now that Count Odo could change, you know? If there is a... Oh, no. Please don't come this way, dude. Really? Why oh, you gotta be in front of it? You better go back the other way. And then I am gonna slip myself in there. Wait for it. Hopefully. <gasps> no. Oh my god, no. Not like this. 
Holy frick. Okay, he's headed back. Now's my ch chance. Now's my chance. I'm in. Let's go. What good are our deaths, my lord? Your lady wife lies dying. Go to her. Your duty as a husband. My duty is here. When Charles and his army arrive, we will join the attack. We will crush the heathens between the hammer of Charles and the anvil of Paris. Um. Leave, Walter. Go comfort my wife as best you can. God, it seems, has chosen a different fate for me. The priest is right. Lay down your arms. Save your city. Among the Northmen, is not death in battle the best way to die? Come, share a glass of wine with a doomed man. I have heard many a warrior cry out for their mothers as their life's blood feeds the ground. I no longer can say if this is the best way to die. Your wife's wound is severe, an arrow to the gut. I saw her. I fear she won't last the night. And I won't last the next quarter of an hour. She said to be strong for your children. Do not throw away your life for a mad king. Look at these works of stained glass. Delicate. Priceless. Evro's artisans spend years crafting each piece. Wondrous works, I grant you that. We brought them here for safekeeping. In the hopes that your invading horde won't smash them to pieces. You tell me to surrender my city? Abandon my honor? You tell me to live out my days as Siegfried's prisoner? What would you do? I would fight. And someday, I will die with steel in my hand. As I know. It is my doom. But today is not that day. And if I put you on your back, bleeding out and crying for your mother? My mother's dead. My mother is already dead. Oh, wow. <laughs> Come on, oh. shoot! Bleed from her. Okay, wasn't ready for that. Come here. Piece of crap. Sticky bomb. Yeah, I love that. Piece of freaking crap. This is for my family. Do not make me slay you. Honor demands one of us. Oh, God. Jesus. Okay, easy. All right, you want to play? You want to play? If there is an option to spare him, I will. I think... I think he is a good man. I don't think he wants to die. Oh. Okay. Alright. Oh, jeez. Yeah, take it. The spear is so sick. It is like saving my life here. Heck no. No, you don't. You ain't healing. No healing for you today. Oh. Oh. Shoot. All right, all right, all right. We almost got him. His golden bar is almost down. Whoa. Take your time, take your time. Oh. Oh. There it is! 
Let's freaking go. A fine blade for a fine warrior. You fought well, Count Dodo. But not well enough. <clears throat> Give me a quick death. Do not make a spectacle of my defeat. Those are not Siegfried's horns. Shar and his army! He arrives in time to save the city. They do not fight. I see a flag of truce. Siegfried and Charles would hold parley. I must be there. My voice must be heard. As should I. But I am your prisoner. Then I release you on your honor. And trust you to keep our truce. Thank you, Eivor. I shall. Nice. I had a feeling, man. He was a good man. And I was right. But there was no choice. Okay. Interesting. Lord Siegfried. I offer a gift of silver as a token of the love and friendship between us. Let us have peace. Silver for a truce. Not a truce, but a lasting bond. I name you my Lord of Rouen, and you bend the knee to your king. I do not kneel to wooden gods, let alone living men. But no matter, let me take counsel. Eivor, thank the gods you live. As do you. Good. I made it inside the palace. Odo would have surrendered the city, but... But Charles showed up with his mighty flag of truce. Aye. And you? After we split up, I took my thanes and secured the bastard prince. He's nearby. Safe. Eivor! <laughs> the gods do favor the brave. The lucky and the brave. So it is said. And Charles, he offers us a hoard of silver. Ah, indeed. And all we have to do is sail away. He brings enough treasure to make every war thane here wealthy beyond dreams. For those who lived. Gambling our lives for silver, that is our way. Now, do we take his offer? By luck, he's bloody balls, yes. And call him king if it makes the old troll happy. Take the king's money. Charles cannot be trusted. I... This... You know... Let me tell you something. This whole time in this DLC when we first met Charles, I did not trust him at all. You lead this army. No, I don't like that. I like this one a lot because I really don't trust Charles. I think he is going to be probably the main bad guy in all of this. So we'll see what, what happens. But I'm going with this one. I've dealt with Charles more than you. He may stab us in the back. He can try. And if he tries, I will take his silver and his throne. Uncle, we came for wealth and peace for our clan. We can't take all of Francia. We're too few. Charles, we take your gift. And in return, we give you peace. Siegfried. This man, Siegfried, swears to be my loyal friend and protect our lands in Amiens and Rouen. Gosla, Abel, and my wife died defending Paris from these river pirates. And now, you offer them the very silver we paid you to defend us. Are you mad? Wait. We know you are. Let me ask instead. 
Are you a coward or a fool? Secret swears to protect our lands in the north. If you surrender my birthright, you are no king of mine. Count Odo, I bested you in battle and spared your life. Honor the terms of our truce. This heathen knows more about honor than my king. Today has been a good day, but I tire of long speeches. We will take our silver and go. You Franks may stay and pursue your own quarrels. Wait. A final matter. Eivor of England, bring forth my son. Oh no. It's Belnar. You may have the boy. I will not hand over the boy. Ah, oh, shoot. I... Shoot, shoot, shoot. I might... I have to think about this. The queen's been really, really good to me. Alright. That's the thing about all this. And I would basically betray her trust... If I just hand it over the boy. So. Fact of the matter is. If I do say you may have the boy. Maybe the queen will be the the bad person in all of this. Because you know. I She trusted me with everything. And. Yeah. So. I, oh gosh. That's. um. I don't know man. That's just, uh, I don't know what to do. I really don't know what to do. Um, I want to say I, I can't hand over the boy just because of the queen's sake. I cannot hand over the boy to one such as you. He's free to go where he wills. Shoot. Dare defy me? Do you want battle, king? I will take your silver and your balls. Do not wreck our truce over one small boy. Bernard is not any boy. He is my only son and heir. What? Have you forgotten how to make another? Oh. This is not over, Eivor of England. Ah, we have won a great victory and a great treasure. Come, we feast. Tomorrow, the Franks will bury their dead, thanking their God that they yet live. And they should, for Paris was merely kissed this time. Should we breach those walls again, we will bare our teeth and bite. And should Charles judge it wise to draw swords against us again, let him remember the glint of our axe blades. Let him remember the red mist on the air, the taste of iron. Enjoy the feast all! A purse full of silver to any who can drink more ale than I! Skull! Okay. I don't know, man. Something's... Have you ever seen something like this? Something's not right. What is this? Racing against pigs? <laughs> yes! What is more amusing than watching drunken men race against pigs? 
<laughs> We've done worse things to entertain ourselves. Would you like to try, Eivor? There is a small price for the winner. Or are you not fast enough? Explain the race to me. Run along the lead pathway as fast as that old swine, Hermod. The first to do two laps wins. Alright, where do I start? A <laughs> good sport, Eivor. You will start here. Run when the pig starts running. To raise the stakes and fun, I will join you too. Oh wow. Ready? We're racing a pig. Oh boy. Oh my goodness, man. This is so funny. Hopefully I'm going the right way. Alright, we're good, we're good. Look at me, man. I'm killing it. Oh shoot. Wait. Uh What? Look at us losing to a pig. The gods surely sent Colin Bursty. <laughs> How they mock us. Yo, that scared me a bit. Like it was kind of blocked off. Easy race. Too easy. And done. Easy. Another victory for my saga. Seems your legs were blessed. Uh, no matter the winner, the joy was in the doing. Indeed. And we sure slice open Frankia's belly this time, eh? Now to feast on her entrails. The winnings are worthy of a serpent's lair. And the roads glisten from the dew of slaughter. Yes. Though, one wonders if such butchery was needed. No lessons today, Eivor. I doubt I will remember them. <laughs> you will listen. You are very drunk. No lessons today. <laughs> Truly, Toka. Tonight we drink. And tomorrow... Uh, we vomit. <laughs> <laughs> you are hopeless. That is clear. I took a handsome sword with the fighting. Have it. A keepsake to remember this day by. You honor me. I will cherish the blade. By the way, I was glad you did not turn over Bernard. I miss Sinric, but a father like Charles is worse than no father at all. Facts. I could not doom the boy. It is not a price I think my clan would have me pay for their safety. So true, man. Ring sword, okay. It's complete crap, but I'll stick with what I have. Ah, Eivor! Here is something even you have never done. Tossing food for sport. Oh, man. She's throwing? The most pungent game of them all. Nastier than Charles himself. You enjoy this? I prefer to eat the cheese, but who am I to question the games of the people? So, want to toss some cheese? Sure, I guess. Well, not hurt to try. Should be easy. <laughs> Just try not to hit anyone. So I just up throw it. Up oh, need to throw harder than that. Is that it? Good throw, Evor. Never underestimate the cheese. Did I underestimate the... You definitely earned the prize, so here, some stray silver from the spoils of Paris. You expected a different outcome. I thought you best for rallying a siege and swinging a sharp stick. Was not sure how you would toss some cheese. <laughs> There's much about me you don't know, Pierre. Oh, pray tell, what else should I know? Oh my gosh, no man. <laughs> Worry not about what I might teach. Right. Plenty to celebrate about this night. Don't let me spoil your fun. Go on. 
That's funny that you can actually have a flirt option. A little ale may have lifted his spirits by now. I don't know, man. Something's got to give here. Like, we're celebrating for now, yeah, but come on. I've seen too much Vikings. Eivor the Talker. Quite a trope of just secret. What were you doing with Count Odo? As Charles's army marched on me and my men. I was trying to gain his surrender. What of it? Is it not strange that you met with Odo, Richardis, even Charles himself, and yet all three still walk around with their heads? Everything I've done has been for my clan. It is curious that we must drench our blades in battle sweat to enjoy a night like this. We are warriors. We need not fight to feast. This is a celebration for our dead. Oh. I mean, I, I like this one a lot. This celebration is not about us and those we killed. It is for our dead. So that we may honor them. <laughs> the Frankish blood, the feasting. I still feel nothing. I find no peace in any of it. You avenged your murdered people. You gained glory in their names. Is that why I did what I did? Vengeance and glory. I wonder anymore why any of us do the things we do. Is it Valhalla? Is it clan? Or maybe... We grant ourselves reasons to go from one mead cup to the next. Maybe there are no reasons. And we are no different than wolves. Driven by some inner hunger we can never understand. That may be. But for the sake of our peoples, we must continue to act otherwise. No. I do not believe there is a hall waiting for us. This world is a hall. We get but one. I shall not pretend. Frankia's cup overflows with lush farmland, fat farmers and fatter purses. All the more for us to drink. Tomorrow, we quit this place and head south for greater bounties than even a king can grow. We gave Charles our word. Our word? You are the one who failed to return his son Bernard. Have you forgotten? That was different. Charles would have... Fuck Charles! We spared Paris today, but tomorrow we march for Burgundy. And after that, all of Francia. Uh-oh. I cannot let you do it, Siegfried. Then stop me. So maybe he's the bad guy? <laughs> oh no. I need to go after him. Where'd you go, buddy? We can talk about this, alright? There's no need for more bloodshed. I seriously hope he's alright. Soon and guide me. Oh boy, I don't like the look of this. Burial mounds. Will it be a home gang then, Wolf Kissed? Uh oh. I only ask that you honor your agreement. What does a crow starver like Charles know about honor? I owe him nothing. And he owes me everything. No amount of Frankish blood will bring Sinric or the others back. Some wrongs can never be made right. 
All this talk of right and wrong, honor, as if we can judge. It has no meaning. Can we explain all the blood on our hands, Eivor? Or are we two jesters on this Frankish stage, awaiting our final performance? Draw your weapon. There is no way to find peace. Fine, I will kill you. Okay, no. If you want to find peace, this is not the way. We must build fresh bonds. Look forward to something new. Look forward, look back. It is death in both directions. We are but a morning fog that will inevitably lift. Now answer my challenge or dishonor yourself. Your problem is yourself. You leave me no choice but to kill you. Yeah, yeah, your problem. Your sorrow will linger if you do not face it directly. My blood, the blood of more Franks, will be no solve for your grief. It is as if you speak with Sinric's voice. I have been at sea with no stars to guide by since he died. And if your brother were here, what would be his counsel? To move forward. To live. My time here is over. My kin are dead. The ones who remain must decide what is right for themselves. Let it be Toka's time. What will you do? Leave this place. Ask different questions. Forget everything I know and... find a new way. going away then I am going with him no Toga your clan needs you wow I was not expecting that He was not himself since my father died. A solitary man. But never more so than when he stood alone, tasked with rousing our desperate clan. He led well, but all leaders must one day step aside. That, or see others die because they held on to power for too long. When his strong voice echoed in this place, we knew what to do. We had courage, daring. And his fire still burns in your folk. Skull. Skull. I lack a taste for mulled wine. Sometimes a leader must drink the thing they wish not to. I have word from Count Odo. What does he want? An audience with Eivor. It is urgent. He says the Queen may be in peril. My spies confirmed this. Charles has been hunting again for her and the boy. What do you think? Odo would not lie. If he says it's urgent, I must go. I owe the Queen a debt, and I am honor-bound to see this through. Then go. You have fortune's favor, Wolfkist.
I forgot I was muted right there. <laughs> I was just like walking around just uh, trying to do my outro. But anyways, I'm going to leave it off right here. Like I said, this is going to be awesome. The next, uh, uh, the next part will be the finale, everyone. I'm really excited to see how this ends. And uh, I feel like King Charles is definitely going to be the ending. I feel like he's the bad guy in all of this. But who knows? Maybe Count Odo will do something. But we'll see how it goes. But with that being said, thank you all so much for watching. You guys are the best and only assassination family on YouTube. Going big and growing strong. I love you all. And if you're new, be sure to subscribe to the assassination family today. I'd be honored to have you on this 2022 journey with me. And as always... I'll see all of you guys and girls in the next video. Assassin 4259. Ooh, the snow. Nice. Out.